If you wanna play your favorite games just like the masters, follow Will's tips because he's the fucking man. Will's video game tips. Ultimate, ultimate video game tips. Damn it. How to play Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Three Raven Shield. Alright, well, we're gonna be doing the second level of the game, and the first thing you gotta do is make sure you're only using one guy. That's right. Okay, and make sure he's got the automatic shotgun, because, uh, trust me, this is gonna help. Now go ahead and get the slugs for the auto shotty and the mini scope, which helps out a lot. Now for the pistol, you're gonna want the least powerful one, and you might think to use the high capacity magazine, but use the sound suppressor because it makes the pistol way less powerful. Make sure you have plenty, plenty of breaching charges, okay? You're not gonna actually use them, but you're gonna wanna have them. Now you might think, okay, well, it's winter, so you want the winter camo, but no, go with the black, because it's gonna help you blend right in. So set your entry point. For this level, there's only one, and you might wanna look at the map, but trust me, that's not gonna help at all, so don't even worry about it. Make sure your one dude's ready right here and start the game. Watch the crossfire from the houses. They've got good coverage of the town hall. Okay, you can ignore that guy. Now, when you get your bearings, go ahead and head towards wherever you want to go at a full run. Don't even worry about sneaking around. Just, just as soon as you see a guy like that, just shoot him. Open the door. There's no real need to be careful or sneak around. Now, you might want to hesitate. Hesitating's okay. And checking rooms, probably. Just every time you hear anything, just turn and shoot until it's dead. Not a problem, okay? After you've killed everything on a long distance shot like that, you might want to go ahead and look through the scope after it's dead. And uh, trust me, that shotgun's got a range on it. Normally, you won't want to sneak up behind your enemies. You're going to want to take them directly from the front, but we can make some exceptions. All right, so take down all the guys that you encounter and just go ahead and open random doors and revisit rooms you've already been in because why not? All right, now instead of taking the ladder, you're just going to want to go ahead and fall off the edge like this and maybe it'll hurt you. If it hurts you, that's okay. Don't worry about it. Taking the ladder is way too long. All right, now target an enemy and then just completely ignore them and go the other way because it doesn't matter. Just run around. I mean, just shoot guys, see how this works, it's amazing, okay? Reload every once in a while, if you want, that's up to you, like, nobody really cares. Alright, and of course, if the first bullet doesn't take him down, then just shoot him again. Okay, now we're gonna encounter a hostage, right here, so just shoot everyone in the room. And then look at the hostage. You might want to shoot the hostage, but don't because that will make you lose the game. So just go ahead and check out the other door here. And okay, that looks pretty clear. Don't even worry about it. Now we're going to try and get this jerk back to the extraction zone. All right, if there's any guys you missed, that's good. It gives you something to do on the way back, not to worry. Okay, see, now you know that you've beat the level whenever everything fades out all weird, okay? And you can tell right here where it says, you know, mission completed, everything's fine, guy's still alive, there you go. And that concludes Will's ultimate video game tips. Thank you. Do you suck at first person shooters? Do your friends call you noob sauce and then eat you for breakfast? Tired of your face getting capone zord by shotgun blasts? If you said yes to any or all of these questions, then you need serious professional gaming help. If there's a game that you just can't get the hang of, or if you just want to see more of these videos, then send me an email with the game's title to willprowl at onecliplift.com. If I have the game or plan on getting it, I'll make a video chock full of helpful tips just for you.